card games. Let's get my daily. Give me what I need. I need my daily login gems. So it was interesting to start this up for the first time. Brand new file. Everything from scratch. It was like the two year anniversary that this game had come out. And I got like over 5,000 free gems. It was ridiculous. So that's how I was able to build a deck. Let's... Let me show you the deck I've been working with. And then we'll go get some cards. I call it Burning Marshmallows. It's a... It's a Trickstar deck. Got... Basically, I've got a group of idols that cause burn damage. I'm going to kill you with cuteness. For those who have never heard of this archetype, it's a bunch of idols, but they all work together to burn their opponent to cinders. Basically, everything you do when a Trickstar monster is on the field causes burn damage. The most... The most damning of them is Lycoris. Every time your opponent draws a card, they take burn damage. In a world where Max C is still legal, at least for now, this thing causes the most burn damage ever. Combine that with Candina, where if they activate spells and traps, they take damage. You've got, uh, let's, let's see, the big ringleader. Let's get her out here. Uh, the big ringleader herself, Holly Angel. If she's pointing to a Trickstar monster, awesome, they can't be killed. Also, every time something happens via effect damage from a Trickstar monster, she gains attack. It's one gigantic constant burn. And that's what we're going to try to do. I've got a few other cards in my deck to help out with the burn damage, like this one right here. Put three of these on the field, get one Lycoris out there, and you're dealing one-eighth of their life points every single time they draw a card. Freaking ridiculous. We're going to be dueling randos today, adjusting the deck as necessary. I do know there are a few archetypes where I went up against them and I immediately failed. Arm Dragon and Dark Magician are my current hurdles. They hurt me a lot with this deck because I'm not able to get in anything. So let's buy some cards. I think they just introduced the Mechancos into here, so that sounds fun. Uh, yeah, here they are. We also have Pearlies that we can get. I have no idea what these cards do, but it's kind of fun. You know what? Since these are secret packs, let's go ahead and get these. I do know kind of the details about the Mechancos. Basically, when they're out on the field, any damage that you would take, your opponent takes instead. I actually had somebody who fought me with these ladies, and they attacked me and dealt 4,000 life points to me. Because most of these Mechancos have zero attack points. So if my monster is a big beat stick, they come running directly at me, and I get hurt for the damage. So let's get some cards, why don't we? I have not spent a cent in this game, by the way. I'm going to try to keep it that way. Let's see what we get. Woo! Cards! Virtual things! Wow! Also, you're going to be seeing me basically glaze over all the cards. If one shows up that looks cool, let me know. I normally read the super rares and ultra rares just to see what we're dealing with. But most of the time, I see a card and I go, huh, that's neat, and then never look at it again. A sushi. Okay. 
All right, here we go. Hopefully we get, we actually do get an ultra rare in here. Yeah, we do. What is that ultra rare? I hope it's the one I want. It is not. Okay. Still the Mechanko card. Oh, thanks, Ike. What's up, man? Ooh, these have bamboo swords. Golden and burning. Ooh, and the soul devouring. Okay. I think we can work with these. Again, if I find a if I find a different archetype that I actually enjoy, I might go for those. Maybe I'll make a deck based around Hungry Burger. Yeah, we're doing the Yu-Gi-Oh gotcha. Got four packs left. Yeah, this is a lot different from Genshin. When I get a waifu, they're on a card. They're not actually real. It's like all my real girls that get in Genshin Impact. Yes, I've... I actually have a few of the Hungry Burger cards. That's an archetype from, like, back in 2003. It got support last year, I think. And I actually... I like the archetype. It's kind of funny. I don't see anything that looks interesting. We got the Guardians in here. That's cool. And some Dark Crisis love. Contract with Exodia. Huh. You know, I think I would actually like to go for an Exodia deck just to be really mean. As you could probably tell, I don't actually want to play Yu-Gi-Oh! I just want to win. <laughs> Alright, Piercing Winds... And Awakening... Which one was it? Oh, nah, I don't want that. Alright, what did I get? When face-up mo uh, monster your opponent controls, equip that face-up monster to one of Makanko monsters and equip spell. Then if you... Then if a ritual monster card is on the field, 500 points of damage for each equip spell you control. You manage this card from the graveyard, special summon one Mechanko. Okay, so it's strictly Mechanko. How about those Gunkan Su ship? Two level fours. If this card is Xyz summoned, you can apply these effects in sequence based on the materials used. You can use the effect of Gunkan Sun ship uh, once per turn. Draw a card or add one. Okay, so this is just more support for that particular archetype. Look at all that motherfucking text! And it doesn't even go with my archetype. So forget about it. Yeah, I don't see anything that looked available to go into my Trickstar deck. No, oh, yeah. Pfft. Because most cards nowadays work with a set archetype. That was fun, though. Got some Nido cards. Uh, we got 400 gems. Yeah, we can't do anything right now. All right. Let's jump into the wild. We're going to be fighting, people. I actually did make it to silver rank two, which is neat. I'm surprised I was able to do that with this archetype. So, uh, yeah, we're going to take our losses. We're going to take our lumps. We're going to get hurt. We're going to hurt back. Let's see if my idols can actually win. The sushi ship archetype is funny. Yes, there are a lot of really fun archetypes. I've seen somebody use a gag Ojama deck. And it works. Trick stars rely on going first. So let's see what we can do. Actual Yu-Gi-Oh! What? Modern Yu-Gi-Oh, I should say. I'm good at the old style. It's not the new style. This is precisely what I need, honestly. Okay, here's what we're gonna do. So, my light stage. I can get a free trick star from my deck. Ooh! Ash Blossom. Okay, I think he's got a hand trap. We'll get my Lycoris out here. 
Uh, Korobane has an effect where if I have no monsters or only trick stars, I can special summon a monster. Maxi, you fool! <laughs> oh, this is gonna fucking hurt. This is gonna hurt you so goddamn much. Now, yeah, go ahead. Now, I'm gonna activate the effect to put Karabane back into my hand to swap out to Lycoris. Boom. Now, every time they draw a card, they are dealt 200 points of damage by Lycoris. But also, every time a Trickstar monster deals effect damage, that's 200 more. So now, if I activate this, where both players draw a card and ditch a card... <laughs> here it comes! <laughs> uh, let's see... go ahead and ditch that. Alright. He drew a card. That hurts. That hurts. Alright, and we haven't summoned anything yet, so here's Candina. I'm gonna activate her effect, where if she comes on the field, I can get a monster... Oh! Okay, that was actually clever. I actually have that card in my deck. Damn it! Well, that's fine. Alright, place that face down. We're good to go. Uh, he played a hand trap to negate my uh, Trick Stars effect. Draw a card. Ouch. Uh, if inflict a bad damage, set one normal trap from your hand or deck. Okay. Yeah, we'll do that. Get rid of uh, Blue Angel here. And all of a sudden... <laughs> so, Disturbance Strategy. Opponent shuffles their entire hand to the deck, draws the same number of cards. There's six cards in that hand. This is gonna hurt. Yeah, Trick Stars. Idols that deal burn damage. Boom! Boom! And we're going to go ahead and place... So, oh, place this face down. Nice little trap for them. You should play a card. It'd be really funny if you did. Well, then again, he might be playing Solitaire here, so I'm just gonna let him go about his way. Negate its effects until the end of turn. Again? Alright. There you go. Alright, so now he has negated Lycoris, which means the hand draw effect will no longer work. At least until the end of the turn. But Candina still works. So if he's going to be activating a bunch of spell or trap cards... Oh, it's trap tricks! We might lose. <laughs> Trap tricks fucking hurt. What else you got? Ah, oh, we got a lot of summoning. I think my monsters are doomed. There's Sarah. Special summon this card from your hand to a point this goes to. Special summon a parallel. Parallel exceed? I don't even know what this archetype is. They're probably going away. Right? Fusion. <laughs> What's the matter? No Link or XCs to play? Should probably read this. You can normal summon one Trap Tricks monster in addition to your normal summon. First time an insect or plant monster you control will be destroyed. It is not destroyed. That is rough. Hey! It's Raflesia! Special summon this card in defense as a normal monster. Okay. Boom. Boom. You can special summon one trap trick monster from your deck with a different name. Alright, so they're getting a lot of monsters on the field. Oh, bullshit. Alright, well, it was worth a shot. You can set one whole normal trap. Yeah, Trap Tricks like to work together with one another, and they also set whole cards, which suck.
Here comes a big monster. Hey, another trap tricks! Special summon one level four or lower insect or plant monster from your grave. Wow! What a dick! Just to get rid of my face down. Mantis from your deck to your hand. Turn it on, return to your hand. Probably returning the one on the field. Yep. Summoning another monster. Unaffected by the effects of whole normal traps. You control a trap six monster. You can special summon this card from your hand. There's all the monsters. Cool. Cannot be destroyed by battle or by card effects. Your opponent cannot target Trap Tricks monsters. Okay, so I can't do anything to the Trap Tricks monsters as long as Rafflesia is on the field. Still has two materials on that Xyz. activation from your deck to your graveyards. Uh, this effect. Okay. Okay. Probably gonna destroy both. Oh, never mind. I'm gonna get a big sum gun. Yup. Big old spider. Ah! Big old spider! Oh, here it goes. Oh, <laughs> uh, here comes the destruction. And why I hate dueling trap tricks. Just constant comboing to remove everything on the opponent's field. Uh, 28, 26. That's almost enough to beat me. Here it comes. There you go. You're not gonna kill my monsters. You can crash right into it, and it's protected because of Rafflesia. God damn it! All right. That was one turn. And... Wow. This... This won't survive. But... I can hope. I can special summon a. <laughs> I can special summon a Trickstar monster. By the way, unless somebody is flexing, I don't surrender. So most of the time, I'll just I'll let them perform their combo. But if they're just doing constant everything, I'm not gonna give them the satisfaction. Fuck them. Get rid of that trap hole garbage. <laughs> My last ditch effort. Maxi! <laughs> Why would you do that? There you go. Salt in the wound. <laughs> oh, that's what that trap hole does? Interesting. Alright. Are you going to flex, or can we end the duel... You have more than enough. So while this is going on, how y'all doing? Just wanted that extra kick in the balls. Appreciate it. At least they got it over with quickly. Oh, you fuckface. Just hit me with your 28. There we go. 
EP. Yeah, I feel that. No longer sick. Awesome. All right, back in. Cute drawing. Nice. Uh oh, might have a blue eyes user. And they ain't gonna hurt. Let's see how we do. Oh, that might be a Slifer user. Ooh, wee! All right. Ditch six cards. There we go, that's what I'm looking for. All right. Summon Candina. Activate this effect to get a Lycoris. Return this to the hand. Activate Chain Summoning because it's on a chain number three. And now I can perform three summons in one turn. So Lycoris will go right here. Candina comes back to the hand. Summon another Lycoris. Normal summon Candina. Activate her effect again. Send it back to the hand by summoning a Lycoris. We are going to summon our, our other Lycoris. And uh, this time I'm actually going to summon Lily Bell. Get her out here. Get out of here. To summon her right here. Going to bring over Lily Bell, whose effect is that she can be summoned automatically if she's brought to the brought to the hand by other means. Instead of being drawn, she can go immediately. And the reason I did that is so I can sack her, bring her out into the field. And Trickstar Bloom has a special effect where. You can force the opponent to draw a card. One, two, three. And now, go ahead and sack Bloom and one of my Lycoris to bring out Holly Angel. So now that Lycoris cannot be affected by card effects. And I've got two of them on the field. Whenever they deal damage to the opponent, Holly Angel just goes up in attack points. One, two. Oh, hey, what's up? What's going on, Chaos? I think they have a hand trap. They got something they can activate now. Let's see how much they end up doing. By the way, I have Lava Golem in here as insurance. Vanquish Soul? That sounds fun. Uh, special summon from the deck. Reveal one monster, special summon one. Uh, with the same attribute, but a different name from your deck. Or return it to the hand during... No, go ahead and let that go through. Once we get to a big son of a gun, I'll, I'll block that. Oh, that's a huge motherfucker! Oh! Maybe I should have blocked it. Draw a card! Okay. Ow. Ow. I really want them to summon 
the big monsters. You can target one uh, special summon this card from your hand. I don't think so. Oh my. It's huge! Oh, this just keeps going, doesn't it? Holly Angel goes up even more. He's gonna go after my Lycoris. No two questions. But still interesting. Let's see. You can target one non-dragon vanquish soul monster from you control, return it to the hand. Special summon this card from your hand, blah 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 blah. Uh revealing monsters in the hand. Unaffected by opponent's card effects. Destroy one other card in the field. Yeah. Alright, we got an elemental deck. There's a Munster. Nah. I'm gonna stop that right there. Should have stopped it earlier, but it's fine. You have an Ash, don't you? Ooh! Target one monster in your opponent's graveyard. That blocks Ash, doesn't it? Yeah, it banishes it. That's what it does. Oh! Well, that's cool. Here, have some damage. Jesus. See us, Lair. Ah, uh, this is gonna hurt. Boom. Boom. Yeah, you're powering up Holly Angel, but I know he's got something to deal with that, and it's gonna suck. Hey, at least I can throw him a Lava Golem and be done with it. Hey, 4,000 attack. That's the most I've ever gotten her to. Alright, here comes the battle. My Lycoris are both gone. Which sucks, but I'll survive. Right, she's protected because she's under Holly Angel. No, don't worry. She's not. There you go, buddy. Alright, now for the fun part. Another position then you can change. Interesting. Ah! Gotcha. Main phase two, what you got? What you got there, bud? Is one card face down, or do I hear two? Uh oh! Rock of the Vanquisher. In the main phase, special summon one Vanquish Soul. Huh. Oh. So you could just special summon it back? That's fucking awesome! This archetype rules! You basically just don't lose monsters. Destroy one other card in the field. Unaffected by your opponents. Oh boy, here they go. The summon. The... Fantastic. It becomes dark. Okay. That was odd. Will we have a streamer versus chat? Uh, I don't know. Are you planning on winning? What, are you afraid of my idols? I really wanted to lava golem them. <laughs> Sack both their monsters, put a giant monster on their side, and then kill it. Alright, well, that was fun. Thank you. Alright, back in. I need to rank up. I do have a few duels I want to show you guys that I saved, just because they're so funny. Ooh. Um... 
What are you thinking, friend? No, I'm going second. Fuck. Shouldn't be too bad. Ah, uh, not the best. Let's see how much he sets up on me. And while we're waiting for this long game of solitaire, again, how y'all doing? Welcome. Thanks for coming to the Master Duel stream. What are we looking at here? Use the field, you can discard one Cyber monster if you do draw two cards. Huh. Okay. Oh, go ahead and do a little bit of this. And... Negate the target's effects. Yeah, we'll do that. I can take some damage. Ow. How could you? Anyway, Candina. Let's get out. Let's get out Lycoris. There's chain two, and then we can activate chain summoning for number three. All right, we get a lot of summons this turn. Bell. Activate her effect to get her out of here, or get her out here automatically. And then go ahead and summon a bloom. And skadoosh. Draw a card, friend! Holly Angel. Alright, that's enough damage for one day. Let's see, its effects are removed, so later. And wasn't that negated? I mean you can draw cards. Go right ahead. There you go. Boom. Boom. I've actually got a few clips where somebody just absolutely effed up in their play. Actually, I have a clip. No joke. Somebody made a deck that is a self-destruct. They made a deck that has so many different steps and they basically nuke themselves because it's funny. And that's a win. Good job, Trick Stars. That's a first turn win, baby! Good job, my lovely idols. Also, good duel, friend. 
I wish I could have seen what your cyberses were capable of, but not today, unfortunately. All right, let me let me find my uh, my save duels because they are just so funny. Oh, hold on, I've got tons of shit to collect. You get gems for doing everything in this game, and it updates daily. Yeah, look at that. Activate a spell card, a fusion monster, a link summon, normal summon, special summon. Just get all the good stuff. Seen self KO decks. Uh, get gems for losing two during events or something. Oh. Well, I wish they would have told me. <laughs> all right, let's uh, let's get the replays. Uh, let's see what we got here. So I lost. I lost to some pretty gnarly decks. Let's take a look at this one. I don't remember this one. And if it looks like it's going extremely fast, it is. It actually edits out the downtime. Okay, I had a good setup. Bring out a Lily Bell, use a Lycoris to put her back into my hand, and then put her back on the deck. Sack her. Get a Bloom out here. Get him to draw a card. Easy. Draw. Gets hurt. Awesome. Hey, draw another card, loser. Get hurt again, idiot. And then you do one of these. Sack him. Go ahead and get out your big mama, Holly Angel. And then there we go. So now, draw, take 200 damage, and also get rid of your hand and draw five cards. Ooh, Ash blossomed. And that's when it started going downhill. <laughs> that's when it all went to shit. I had such a thing going, god damn it. Let's see how many summons we're going to get out of this. Oh, it's a galaxy deck. That's right. All right, so here comes a bunch of galaxy eyes. And they're aware that if they keep summoning, they're going to take more and more damage. But yeah, galaxy eyes, photon dragon, just on the field immediately. Special summon this card in defense position. There they go. And then and then it just becomes a process where you're just waiting to get hit uh, with the, de uh, the deadly blow. Because this guy's going to go away. And they're going to... Get this big motherfucker out here. But the best part is, they gained, like, tons of attack points. And the I think the best part is, it can now make three attacks. But also, it can summon this. So even more attack. 12,000 out of nowhere, and I get hit with a one-hit kill. Huge. Absolutely huge. That was awesome. <laughs> I wasn't even mad when I got hit with that. I was like... Oh, I'm dead. <laughs> it was it was just immediate. Uh, three turns. That should be an interesting one. I can't remember what this one was. Let's take a look. Oh, Jesus. Yeah, this hand wasn't the best. This was not a good hand to start with. Yeah, just get two nightmares out there, and then just put a monster face down and hope to god something happens. Harpy's Feather Duster, already a bad sign. Spells, gone. Ritual Monster comes to the hand, we got Mechankos. Here it is. This is where I started thinking, okay, Mechankos are pretty fucking awesome. <laughs> These are the cards we tried to draw earlier, check this, check this out. All right, so summon a monster from your hand, ignoring summoning conditions. Bam. Zero attack, zero defense, so it can't hurt me. Or can it? So it does a couple sacks. It can be special summoned. Also zero attack, but now it's equipped with this. Here's a trap card. Nice. And then end the turn. But not before dealing 4,000 points of damage to me. Card is returned to the hand. Resummoned. There we go. Uh, I'm pretty screwed if I don't get anything. I got nothing. Sweet. <laughs> hey, we, we might be able to do something with Holly Angel here. 
Bring her out. Hope something happens. Battle. Oh, wait. Here you go. And I killed myself. Oh! That's a great archetype. Self-hurt. What's going on, Quack? Alright, what was another big... Ten turns? Why? Why is this ten turns? Oh, was this the beginner that I almost lost to? Because I made an oopsie and had to dial it back? See, that's a pretty decent starting hand. Get the light stage out there to get a trick star monster. There we go, we got it all set up. Bam! Get a Lycoris out there, summon her back, get chain summoning so I can do three summons at the same for the same turn. It's great, we got it going on. Summon her, bring her back, get a monster, Lily Bell, bring her out with a special summon, sack her, get Bloom. As you can see, I kind of got the strategy down, but I still make mistakes. Let him draw a card, get damaged, get damaged again, bring her out, summon another monster, but bring her back because, <laughs> because I'm going to be a piece of shit. Summon a Korribane, just in case something fucky happens. Sack these two. And bring out Mama. And end the turn. They draw cards. They take damage immediately. This is going great. And especially when I activate the trap to make them remove their entire hand. And draw the same number of cards, so that's 1400 damage, I think. Her Lycoris. Boom. 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 See, this is why I like Trick Stars. They are a nuisance. They just keep dealing damage. It is ridiculous. Alright, cool. 5200. What you got? Cool, you're using a starter deck. Nice. Here you go. Sat Kurabane in order to give her attack points to another trick star. Sweet. Alright, I think we got something. Summon a Lily Bell. There, dealt damage. Regeki Break. Ditch a card and destroy a card in the field. Holly Angel's going down. But also, special summoning a dragon monster from the graveyard. Luster, which I can't get over. Dust Tornado is getting rid of my stage. That's not good. That's actually terrible. Alright. Let's do this again. Let's do a little bit more burn damage. Here's Bloom. Draw a card. Boom. Boom. And now we'll summon another Holly Angel. Actually, no. This is somebody different. This is Bla uh, Black Cat Bat. And sack those two. To summon Foxglove Witch. 200 points for each card they control. Attack, there we go. And now, for some reason, it's not over. It should have been over by now, but that's okay. Back to square one. Card's going back to the hand. And also, they're summoning another dragon monster. <laughs> the dragon starter deck is actually really good. Yeah. Go ahead and use Chain Destruction, that's fine. Ow. Ow. Alright, so nothing in either of our hands. Draw nothing. I could do Pot of Extravagance, sack six cards in my extra deck to draw two cards, and now we have a problem. <laughs> Ditch your hand and draw five, but also get rid of your hand again. So draw one and then draw five. I mainly did that to get this card in the graveyard so I can banish it and put a monster back out on the field. There. And then they summon a blue eyes white dragon. I'm going to lose to a starter deck. Ha! 
So I have nothing. I can't summon Lava Golem. I need to hope that they don't get anything. They threw. 600 points left. And guess what? Lava Golem will be their demise. Draw. Doesn't matter. Sack both of their monsters to summon Lava Golem. They can special summon a monster from their de uh, from their hand. They summon a solid dragon. And they summon a blue eyes white dragon for free. But it actually doesn't matter because as soon as it's their turn, Lava Golem burns. Boom. Worth it. That's why I have Lava Golem in my deck. For jet like that. That was a fun duel. Alright, where's the... Is this the guy that blew himself up? I think it might be. Let's see if this is the guy that blew himself up. Yeah, I wasn't expecting to almost lose to a starter deck. I'm still learning, by the way. Alright, let's see what we got here. Okay, good start, good start. Infinite impermanence is fine. Yeah, they're burning themselves. Oh, it, yeah, it's a Zodiac deck where they uh, where they burn themselves. All right, here they go. Three thousand damage. Wow. So all the Zodiacs self summon themselves essentially. Basically throwing them into a volcano. Alright, they go ahead and sack that, and then bring out another Zodiac. Sack that for another Zodiac. Oh, this guy has a portrait. It must be really good. Oh, detach one material, face up card, destroy it. Awesome. Well, anyway. Oh no! What are they gonna do? But when that card's destroyed, they are dealt 6,000 damage. I got to draw a card in that duel. It was great. <laughs> that was really funny. Good on you, mate. That was really fun. All right, back in. Let's see what other archetypes I could find. Yeah, that was an awesome match. That is a, a self-destruction deck. And I couldn't have been happier to have been a part of that. Do I get to go first? No. Alright, enjoy your cards, mate. That is not the best start. I might be able to work with this. Maybe. Alright, let's see what they got. See you, dragon. I'm waiting patiently. Okay, ow. Good start, good start. We love burn. Oh, it was to summon a monster. Oh, Jesus. This card was summoned this way. Owner's control is destroyed by an opponent's card effect. Gain 5,000 life points. Owner's control is destroyed by an opponent's card. Okay. 
one DDD monster from your hand into fist, but, but its effects are negated. Revival Jam? You're using a lot of life points there, mate. Huh. By an opponent's card, gain 5,000 life points. Well, I don't think we'll have to worry about that. Hey, Lily Bell. What's going on, Goyle? All right, let's see what I can do here. What you got? You don't have a hand. So that's good. Tower of Babel? What does that do? Each time a spell card is activated, place one spell counter on this. Uh, by destroy this card, and if you do, player who activated the spell card takes 3,000 damage. They're dealing in huge numbers here. But hey. This means I can actually summon all that I wanted to summon. Uh, target one trickstar monster, one phase one phase. No. Lycoris out here. Activate the effect. Back into the hand. the effect to bring her out onto the field and then Candina one more time to summon Lily Bell and activate this effect Turn that Trickstar monster to the hand, and if you do... Okay. Trickstar Bouquet. One to return to the hand. One monster to gain the attack. Cool. Uh, here. Ow. You know what? Lily Bell can attack directly. <laughs> Boom! And uh, you know what? Let's let's attack the jam. And if they use life points to bring him back. Oh, they got something going on. Oh, yep. All right, cool. I could just end my turn. That's neat. What's up to the max? How we doing? They almost had Tower of Babel. They had a pretty decent burn deck. I'll go ahead and end my turn, and I win. Hooray! Burn! It still had to get that one last burn in there. Jesus. Oh no! 
I always hate to hear that businesses are closing. That was a fun duel. A lot of burn. Alright, let's see if we can get a gold rank. Off we go! Oh, what the hell is that thing? Oh boy. So what do you think, opponent? Am I going first? Please? 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 Oh no! We'll never know! Whatever the hell that was. A Red Eyes Fusion deck? That sounds badass! Wait, you actually knew what that was? Clipport Monolith. Is that an archetype? That sounds pretty badass if that is an archetype. Oh, what a disgusting hand! Oh, what the fuck is this? This is gross, is what it is. There you go. Have a dark room and nightmare. And, uh... Ugh. All right, well, anyway. Uh, fuck. This is... This is bad. <laughs> I got a bricked hand! No! All right, let's see what you got, buddy. I maybe should have saved my dark room and nightmare, but now that they know that it's trick stars, they're probably gonna ruin me. What is this? A red familiar. Ow. I uh, tribute one fiend monster. Wait, but uh, you can negate its effects. Wait, really? Thank you. Fuck! I need monsters. All right. Uh. At least I can get a Trickstar token out there. I need to get something, man. Alright, that was it. <laughs> yeah, one monster attacking in the turn. Yeah. We got fiends. I'm not sure what this archetype is. Oh, yep, Archfiends. You called it. Here comes the Archfiends. Any advice on playing hardcore? Don't get discouraged when you die. Also, basically unlearn everything you knew about the original playthrough because it has changed. We got some synchro summons coming up. Here it comes. Send one card. Appeals to the Griever. Special summons cards. Monster from the extra, extra deck. Increase the level. Alright, we're getting a synchro summon. In your graveyard, special summon it in defense position. Okay. Normal summon, add one level four, lower monster in the field, soul resonator. I'm either gonna get hit for all my life points, or we're gonna get a huge ass synchro summon. Thanks for Necro. What's going on, mate? Playing some Master Duel. Aw, and thanks for the tier one sub. Appreciate you. Or thanks for the resub. Here comes the synchro! Archfiends! Woo! Can I face you? Uh, maybe at the end. What the hell is this? Monarchs! Oh, why would you do that? No. I need that. Oh, there goes that, and I'm about to get hurt. Alright, well, this is why I have Raigeki. The sole reason on why I have Regeki. Monster? Oh, fuck off. <laughs> uh, uh. There you go. Eat this. Please don't block it. That'd be really... 
it went through? Did I seriously hit a Regeki in modern Yu-Gi-Oh? Yeah, I think I did. Oh, so, uh, something gets saved. Okay, the Archfiend got saved. I've been bricked. I can't get out of this shit. Eh, you know what? I'll just get rid of his hand. Just be a douche. I don't have any trick stars. <laughs> Fuck! Fuck! Uh. Alright. Draw your cards so I can just get rid of them. Witch of the Black Forest! Here you go. Eat this. Enjoy your free cards. <laughs> <laughs> oh, holy shit. I'm getting ruined. Hopefully that helped you, friend. What the hell? Ooh. All right, I did lose. Fuck yeah. That was rough. <laughs> I might need to retune the deck a little bit. Ugh. And skadoosh. Boom. Congratulations, friend. Good duel, good duel. That is the first time I have gotten bricked in the Trickstar deck. Insanity. A friend won using Mimicking Man Eater Bug. What is that? Sounds funny. Hey, I'm going first. Alright, let's actually have a hand this time. I would love it. There are a lot of spell cards in this deck, so that's probably where I can slim it down and get some extra trick stars in there. But the trick star archetype just barely has anything. Which is unfortunate. And speaking of that, ooh, you have Max C, don't you? You have to. I'm picking up what you're putting down. If you really want to max C, by all means, friend, do it. It's a man eater bug that can't die from battle and eats the monster and takes their attack points. Whoa! That sounds awesome, actually. Boop. Go ahead and get six cards. This is not doing well. Fucking monster, finally. Alright. Jesus. There. Alright. Put that down. And that down. Here we go. <clears throat> I'm proud of you, you didn't use your Max C. What is the point of this deck? Burn. Ooh, I saw something in there I didn't like. Uh, trick stars r work together really well and they cause burn damage. Basically, anything you do when there's a field full of trick stars will cause burn damage. If these duels had only four... Oh my god, are you serious, mate? Oh, now I just feel bad. Wow. Well. Uh... Oh, jeez. Oh, okay. Hi, Lily Bell. Why is Lava Golem in here? Insurance. Because I can sack other people's monsters and it'll deal burn damage on their turn.
because you throw a lava golem on their side of the field, if it's on your side, or their side, they take a thousand points of damage. It is a kaiju, yes. It is the first kaiju. Before kaijus were even an archetype. Oh man. Well, this kind of sucks. So, what's, what's what's going on, man? We, we doing cool? Uh, I feel bad. And yeah, we'll go ahead and attack. All right, let's see you get a card. Bam, combo right here. You're gonna have to. No, it's... If it's on your field. So you sack two of your... What the hell? You sack two of your opponent's monsters, it goes to their field, and as you're reading it, it is on your field, AKA your opponent, and they take a thousand points of damage. It has always been like that. There's There was some slight uh, readjusting in the text, but point still stands. Man, that was a that was a sad duel. I feel bad for you, mate. I wish you would have been able to play a card. Oh, hey! I got an achievement! Woohoo! Yeah, it's a... Uh, you're giving your opponent a 3,000 attack point monster. Holy shit, another achievement. Awesome. Do I hear another? Yay, I'm in gold rank. All right, let's do another. For funsies. Elemental hero, huh? All right. I hope to eventually get a combo that goes so well that they don't even get to move. No, 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 no. It's on your... It's on your opponent's standby phases when they take the damage. It's activated, you can add one trick star monster from the graveyard to your hand. Okay, we'll do that next turn. I can't believe this works. Ooh, if I had more monsters. Damn. Technically I did, but nah, it's fine. Okay. That's enough damage for one round. Oh, you have an IP Mascarena. That's neat. Boom. All right, let's see what you got.
Uh, I'm sorry, what? Oh! What the hell is this? By attributing all face-up monsters on the field that activated their effects this turn. Oh, that's a counter to Trick Stars! Uh-oh. Your opponent's graveyard special summon it to your field. <laughs> Banish one fiend monster from your graveyard, discard one fiend monster, then draw a card, okay? I don't like that amount of attack. 1500 for each monster tributed to special summon this card. Ew! Oh, you can do so much with that. That's disgusting. I'm about to get hurt a lot. Kurikara, Divine Carnage. Okay. That seems fun. I have never heard of this archetype before. Okay, monster on the field, nice. Oh, it has to do with Dark World? Uh-oh. <laughs> yeah, it's a Dark World deck. Uh-oh. Uh, 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 33, uh, 2000 plus 16, yeah, that'll work. Here you go. Thanks, Korobane. Ah, oh, fuck! I did math wrong! Shit! Aw, oh, man! Well, at least he stopped attacking. That's cool. I'm actually surprised they stopped attacking. I, I should be a lot more hurt than I am. Unless I scared them off with my idols. Or their connections dropping. Uh oh Come on, pick it back up. Face me. Oh, they lost connection. Okay. Well, I don't one hundred percent accept this victory, but it 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 happens. Disconnects happen. The no summon limit is that a f considered a floodgate? More than twice per turn. Ew. Woo. Hello. Yay! I get to go first. Hopefully, I don't get bricked. Yeah. Let's see what you got, friend. Oh yeah, did anybody see the updated ban list, by the way? I have a feeling in the near future, Max C will be off the ban list. And the only reason I say that is because we have a new form of Max C. One that can actually be used. It's like a jellyfish or something like that, where it has the effects of Max C, but it's not like infinite draw. It's a certain number of cards, like up to a certain number or something like that. I just briefly looked over it. Dinomorphia! Dinomorphia card from the deck to the grave. Uh, if your life points are 2,000 or less, inflict 500 points of damage. Special summon Dinomorphia. Okay. Maxine needs to be banned. Uh, this is a brand new card. It's it's not in Master Duel yet. Like, I think... Okay. <laughs> it's in the TCG. A power wash archetype. <laughs> Maybe. Baron did get banned. If I saw that correctly, Baron de Floor is now banned. Fuck that card as well. Oh no, I'm Dilly Nisco. Oh shit. Yeah, Link Kariba was a weird ban. I didn't understand that one. Alright, uh, I'm gonna have to ask you guys. Oh, uh, dual room. I think that's how we do it. Go ahead and create a room. room comment. Max room occupancy. Uh, go ahead and get your master duels up and ready, and we'll play some matches with viewers. Standard, okay. Oh, 
knows? However many people want to be in here. Mmm. This is a private room. Uh, dual time 3 seconds, 8,000 life points. Room list permissions. View replay. Okay. It's cross platform. Okay. Room details. This is a private room. So there's the ID. And uh, go ahead and do the spectator ID if you haven't. If you're not able to get in here. Do I have a deck limit? Like things I don't want to see, or... How do you mean? Because I, I don't mind what you what you play against me. It's perfectly fine. We do have the regular forbidden and limited rules on. Oh yeah, I don't care. If you somehow have a Yada deck that's unbanned, I want to see it. If you want to throw a max C in my face, you can here. Looks like we got two people in here. Awesome. By the way, sound off if if it's you. <laughs> if you're the one in here. Yeah, we're we've we've won a few duels, and now I'm playing with uh playing with chat. Remember, go easy on me. I'm still new. Fuck me up, fam. <laughs> hey, what's up, Cairo? Or Frenekra. Let's see what you got. Also, no cheating, obviously. Turn my feed off. You're not allowed to see my cards. Oh, God, this hand fucking sucks. All right. But I want to! <laughs> Don't! Don't you do it! Don't you screen peek! Tear laments? Uh oh. Special summon this card from your hand. Okay. Fusion summon one fusion monster from your extra deck by placing fusions. Okay, so it helps out with your fusions. There you go. Honorable. Nice. Go ahead and let that through. Whatever combo you had, I didn't like it. Ooh, and Shadal. Ooh. Ooh. <laughs> you can send one Shadal card from your deck to the graveyard. Fuck, I don't know enough about Shadals. All right, I'm going to let him through. And the card to the graveyard, which means it's probably coming back immediately. Yep, came right back. Special summon Shadal monster from your deck and face down defense position. So Shadals don't go down easy is what I'm hearing. Oh my god, they definitely don't. They just come right back. And they're mean. Oh, you would. <laughs> Screw you. Harpy's feather duster. Oh, there it goes. Alright.
Negate the activation. Oh, why? No! <laughs> no, back to the hand! Fuck! Oh my god, it comes again? Nah, we're stopping it this time. Whatever you're about to do, nah. Not into it. You... <laughs> That hurts. deck to the graveyard. You bring in a full field to play? Am I in danger? Oh. We're getting a fusion. Are we getting the big Shadal? The one with the special graphic? Yup! Winda! Uh-oh. I think that's enough to kill me. I think you got me. Oh yeah, you got me. And skadoosh. Congratulations. Good duel, good duel. Uh, let's go by if you, once you play, go ahead and back out of the table so other people can get a chance. And that's what we'll go with. So, for Necro, congratulations with your Shadal deck. Fantastic. Now we got to the max. What's up, man? Yeah, I'm, I'm realizing Shadals are the ones that play from the graveyard, and that sucks. Especially when a lot of those cards can send themselves to the graveyard. So it's a mixture of tier elements and shut all. Oh, it's fine. We are all having fun here, you fucker. No, I'm kidding. <laughs> Just kidding. Just pulling your leg. Told you I'm a shut all player. You think I remember that far back? Like 20 minutes? Tell us how you really feel. I'm feeling great. I get to learn from people who have played modern Yu-Gi-Oh! And get my ass kicked. Hey, there's Red Eyes. Destroyed by battle and sent to the graveyard to special summon one Red Eyes from your deck. Okay. This card is sent from the field of the graveyard. You can add one level one dragon monster. Interesting. comes red eyes. Black Flare. This card is treated as a normal monster will face up. Following following this card and inflict damage to your opponent's life. Okay. Not a fan of that one. Jesus.
Oh, interesting. Huh? What did you just do? I might almost equip this card from your hand. If you the target. Okay. He's he's getting bigger. Now he's really getting huge! Oh boy. Oops. <gasps> Ooh, Red Eyes Fusion. Are you gonna throw a Red Eyes card at me? Oh, Swords of Revealing Light. What the hell? <laughs> awesome. No, you Ash Blossom. All right, good job, good job. Ah. Uh. Hey, I may not have been able to get rid of your cards, but I can at least summon Kurabane. What we got? Oh, nice. All right. Oh, wait. Can't attack. Sorry, it's been a long time since I've seen a Swords of Revealing Light. Like a long time. Here comes more red eyes. That didn't just stop my own trap, did it? Oh my fucking god! <laughs> oh, I accidentally negated my own trap card! Enjoy your Black Skull Dragon that you're throwing at my face. Oh, what the hell is that? Red Eyes Black Dragon Archfiend? Oh, it wait. Archfiend Black Skull Dragon. Oh. Well, this is going to hurt. It's going to really hurt. Flick damage to your opponent equal to the attack in the graveyard. Shuffle it in. But Ow! Alright, good play, good play. <laughs> Jesus Christ. I'm learning! <laughs> Wee! <laughs> uh, uh, let me think. Yes.
Show me your patio furniture. Oh wow, a legit polymerization! <laughs> when the when on earth does that happen? Oh boy. It, ow! Boral load? Boral load of shit! <laughs> no! Ow! I think I just lost. Uh, yup. Show me the extra damage. Show me that red eyes. And... Bam! Fantastic. It's been a hot minute since I've actually looked at the red eyes archetype. It's gotten good. <laughs> Fantastic. Thank you for the duel. Good match, good match. Yeah, GG. If you have not had a turn, go ahead and jump on in. If you have had a turn, thank you for being patient. Apologies in advance. What does that mean? Yeah, real burn master. <laughs> no, that was really cool. I have never seen that fusion monster before. And the fact that all of your red eyes were in the graveyard and could just be done as extra burn damage. Yikes. Haven't played in forever. Uh, I haven't played at all. I think we're equal. Bring it on, chaos. Oh, you got a little jackalope. Careful, it's dangerous. It's dangerous monster. Who would you like to go first? Teehee. Oh, I'm going first. Thank you. Ooh, Dark Necrofear. That's cool. Hmm. I did, yes. I did mistime my Ash Blossom 110%. I... The chain was... It was bad. <laughs> I should have done Ash first, then my trap card. That goofed me a lot. Hey, speaking of Ash Blossom. Chaos says new. No. Uh, Sims, I'll show the room code after this. Well, you didn't want a new hand? I agree, I agree. Every time I lose, it's a... Oh, you have a Dark Magician deck? Uh-oh. <laughs> Incoming Dark Magicians. All of them. It begins. It might hurt you a lot, though. Let's see how much summoning you're willing to do. When you pulled out of the OG Swords of Revealing Light, I feel old, dude. Add it to your hand, any remaining cards, top of your deck in any order. Okay.
There's about to be a lot of Dark Magician in my face. Almost immediately. The Dark Magician archetype is so fucking good. Because when you have Dark Magic Circle, cards banished. It was fun while it lasted. And we got a battle phase for more than half my life points. If Trick Stars want to have any chance against Dark Magician, they have to win the first turn. Or win on their opponent's turn. Oh! Well, who's this person? I think that was just to get a Dark Magician in the graveyard. I can't believe my bad luck right now. Cool. Anyway. Destroy that opponent's monster. World Chalice, huh? See where this goes. Oh Jesus! Another dark magician! <laughs> oh no! There goes my monster. I lost already. I can see it in the into the future. No! Oh, Dark Magician decks are so OP against a Bricked Hand and also eh, Trick Stars. Ah! Congratulations on your victory. <laughs> I'm kind of curious as to how much more you could get out there on the field. Oh, there you go. That'll do it. <laughs> Another shut all deck. Just want to kick me while I'm down. No, that sounds fine. Uh, we'll get a few more people in here, and then uh, we'll go from there. Soul Servant. Oh, that is a great card! No wonder it's an Ultra Rare. That's just a free Dark Magic Circle use. Oh, wow! Oh, because it mentions to... Oh! Well, that's cool. Yeah, there's a lot of synergy in this archetype hand or face up on the field to the graveyard. Yeah, there goes Magician's Soul. Special summon this card from your hand. Holy fuck. Fusion summon one fusion block. Oh, are you gonna do it? You gonna do it? Let me see it. Dark Magician the Dragon Knight. Yeah, bring on the Dragon Knight, baby! Yeah! Dark Magician, the Knight of Dragon, Mass Magic! <laughs> Ow! Wait, what? <gasps> oh, that's so cool! You get to get both? Oh, that's so cool! What a great combo! Do you have a dragon champion? Oh, yeah, you do! <laughs> awesome! Yeah! Awesome! Congratulations! 
Congrats. That was great. All right. Real quick. Oh, sorry. I, I didn't mean to leave immediately. Uh, here's the code for more people if you wanted to get in here. For those who still want to get in, uh, sound off in chat once you're in. I'm actually going to go get me some water. I will be right back. Sims, you were able to get in. Awesome. All right. Come on in. Yeah, you got the cool one. Sims, are you rocking Dragon Maids? Because I want to see a Dragon Maid deck. Are you rocking dragons, or are you actually just using their visage? I think you're rocking Dragon Maids. Bring it on. Uh-oh. Okay, one second. See you, Chaos. Have fun. Uh, hmm. Apparently I'm spectating this duel that's not happening. Yeah, let's try this again. Yeah, I don't know what happened. My explodey sun usable for A rank runs? I don't know. Oh, there we go. Nope, server's not down. Just struck a bad luck. It happens. Okay. Close. It's Trickstar Candina. Yeah, that first card draw it always hurts the most. Exactly a thousand points. Dragons. No. Don't think so. Because I think you are rack, uh, rocking, uh, racking, rocking dragon maids. Uh oh. A little bit of warm up damage. No harm, no foul. Your turn, friend.
Sims, I'm gonna make you a deal. Because you kind of got bricked and fucked by this by this deck, uh, I'm gonna give you another round because uh, it's over. So let's let's do another one. I feel bad. <laughs> I had to do it one more time. So let's go one more round since you got screwed on your turn. So let's let's do one more. This will be the one for realsies. And is there anybody else in chat who wants to join in? Who wishes to duel? Go ahead and sound off now, and after this table, go ahead and open up the code again if you want to join in. <clears throat> Just downloaded? Nice. I have my fusion in my hand and Ash stopped everything. Yeah, I, I feel bad. Ash normally ruins a lot of combos. Like a lot of them. <laughs> like it fucks everything up. And Dina. Effects. Enjoy your card. You had to pay for it dearly. Nothing personal. It's just how it has to be. Alright. There we go. It's enough damage for one turn. But it's never enough. See, these are the combos I wish I would get during online matches. Uh, Silver, I'm playing this on Xbox. I have it on PC, I have it on PS5, but Xbox has achievements that make me feel good. Alright, let's see what Dragon Maids are capable of. I promise I don't have Ash. Scout's honor. This will hurt, though. From your graveyard and defense position. Ooh. You can only activate. 
attacked me, uh, but a different level from your deck to the graveyard. Okay. There's the parlor dragon maid, my favorite out of all of them. <laughs> hmm. Yep, this is crossplay. You'd like to try against me? Okay. After this duel, I'll open up... Uh, I'll open up the code again so everybody can see it. Interesting. That hurts me. All right. If you want to be that way, here, have this. Still need to figure out where everything goes for Link summoning. That's where it's getting me. This time is all I need to have fun. Oh yeah, to have fun. There you go. Not gonna lie, it feels really good to have a full field, but 
I've done enough. I want to see what you got. This is more research than actually trying to win. I want to see what make meta decks tick. Okay. Awesome. And deck to your hand and send one dragon main monster from your hand to the graveyard. Okay. my holly angels going into my deck. Right? Yep. There she goes. Okay, you got rid of my beat stick. <laughs> that just sounds like such an anime villain sounding taunt. You had a good deck, but the power of my red eyes beat your dolls. Your action figures. That was only one deck. Y'all are cracking me up. Jesus Christ. All right, let's have some fun. Uh, let's see. I end my turn. I can't stop it now. Oh boy. There we go. Jesus. Lycoris. They're already gone. That's what I like about Trick Stars. If your opponent does anything, it's burn damage. There you are, Ike. I'll go ahead and jump in, and let's do them. I'm sorry. Ah, oh, don't be sorry. It's all for fun. Not me just doing things and not reading. Ah, it's fine. Reading? You know, players don't do that. I should know. I'm technically one now. Only game, no mad. Now, if you start flexing on me, that's when I start to get a little pissed. Okay. Let's have some fun.
What happened to the GX game? Oh, we're still playing it. This is just a bonus stream. I just wanted to play some Master Duel, and we hadn't streamed in a while, so I figured I'd jump back in like this. Okay. Uh, yeah, let's go ahead and do it. That's enough fun for one day. Are you winning? Uh, always and also never. I don't win, I just am. Ooh, did you get the blue eyes structure deck? I think he did. Nice, nice. Telling you, the structure decks are the way to go. Oh, speaking of which, I am defenseless. Yeah, you got the blue eyes deck. Nice. Let's change to defense position, okay? Ooh, look at you! Directly, thank you very much. There we go. I just wanted to even the playing field a little bit. Awesome. Piercing damage. Ooh. All right. All right. I see what you're doing. You're evening the playing field again. <laughs> oh, no. Here it comes. Here it comes. Oh, shit. I got it back.
Let's go again. Let's go again. Boom. 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 good match. That blue eye structure deck is actually amazing. Just a couple small tweaks and you can deal so much damage in a, in such a little time. Thanks for the duel, Ike. Alright, I heard we had another person who wanted uh, who wanted to join in, so here's the details. Come on in. Fix your deck first. All right. Go in. Well, how about this? Uh, for Necro, go ahead and jump in here. I'll duel you with your new deck, and then uh, Silver, when you're ready, we'll sub you in. Ah, yep, there we go. Again. Halfway done on Xbox? Okay. Ugh. Ike, if you actually got a lot of the gems for a first-time player, or maybe you've been playing this for a while and I just never noticed, uh, but you can actually... There is a Dragon Maid structure deck if you want to fool around with that one. There might also be a Dark Magician one as well. Could you? Ah, oh, that's mean. Lightning Storm is fun, though. Alright, there's the Shadals again. This has a flip effect? Wow. I haven't seen one of those in a hot minute. Ah, okay. Hilarious. All right. We get into the real meat and potatoes of Shadows. Just comes right back. Do your worst.
wait. That's not a fl well oh wait, that was a flip. No, oh, never mind. And it comes right back. It's almost like a magic trick. There goes my card, and it comes right back to me. not good. <laughs> Alright. Congratulations. Gladiator beasts. Only heard of them in passing. Never actually had a chance to see what they were all about. So, this right here is probably the worst thing I could ever activate for shut alls. Oh, never mind. Bing. Nightmare Unicorn. I've barely seen you. Discard one card. Oh, well. Nah. Just go ahead and activate it. It's easier that way. Now let's see how many shuttles come- You sh- Oh! Alright. Complete and utter domination. Wait, what are you getting rid of? Oh, a Lycoris. Okay. Ah. Oh, and contact fuse. Very nice. Forty is the minimum. And I believe the new ruling is sixty is your maximum. So between forty and sixty. And the only reason they did that. It's because somebody brought a deck to a tournament that had over a thousand... No, not a thousand cards. Uh, like, 500 cards in their deck. And it took close to an hour to shuffle the damn thing. And uh, based on the documentary I watched on YouTube, that was the reason Konami changed the rules. Invocations! Good duel, good duel. I kind of got wrecked. Alright, Silver, if you're ready. And for Necro, if you could back out, thank you very much. Come on in! Let me see your war face! It seems we have lost Silver. In that case, does anybody else want to rematch? Uh, for Necro, since you've had two, if you wouldn't mind just staying on the sidelines just for one or two matches, and then we'll get you back in here. Does anybody else want a rematch? I'm psyched to duel with you. Ike, if you want to go again, I'm ready for you, buddy. Or who, whomever gets in here first. There we go. Pick out, uh, pick out my Earthbound playthrough. Splatoon is going through... Really? Huh. I wonder what the maintenance is for. Probably getting ready for the Splatfest. Alright, 
let's see what we got. Let's see what we got here. We've got not a lot that we can use right now. Not a lot that we can use right now. God damn it. God damn it. I need some motherfucking monsters in my hand. We got a motherfucking monster in my hand. Oh, yeah. Ah, game balance update. That should be good. I don't know how to play a maid deck, be nice to me. You got it. So a lot of the maids depend on summoning their their maid counterpart to be swapped out with their dragon counterpart. Get out of the big old dragon. So bring it on. This is also why they give you 300 seconds so you can read the cards. I know there's a lot on screen. Okay. Got your parlor here. I'm gonna go ahead and activate one of these fun-loving guys. You buffed your main? What main you rocking? Oh! Well, that's not good. <laughs> huh. Oh, dear. No. as possible most of your non-made dragons are there as fusion material interesting it's still good to have a monster out here that can trip up mime Candina, I have a bad feeling you might be perishing here soon Oh, here comes... Oh, boy. Oh! Oh, I'm gonna have to read this. Hmm. Gonna go ahead and buff up this beast. There we go. Yeehaw! We got here. Okay. Uh, let me use one of these. Hmm. 
Well, hello there, paranoid fighter. What's going on? Glad you could make it. Shadows are all flip monsters. What? Oh, what? <laughs> I haven't seen flip monsters in forever. That's amazing. Did this wrong. That's okay. That's okay. We'll make it work. We will make it work. Let me see the dragon maids. Long. Glad you enjoyed the game. It's what we're here for is to show you how fun games can be. And also how annoying some of them can be. Hence some of the bad games we used to play. Uh-oh. That seems like it might hurt. Let me do one of these. No, ride to hell's great. It's great if you just don't like video games. If you're just thinking, man, I really hate video games, actually. <laughs> That's when you bring on ride to hell. a sequel to Ride to Hell. Hopefully it's called The One That Works. The Good One. Even post-op anesthesia made that game make sense. Oh. Well, hopefully we didn't make you laugh or anything like that. You ready? Okay, we'll sub you in after after this duel here. I was too confused to laugh. <laughs> hey, that works. Hmm. We can work with that.
little bouquet. Return. Game. And wait for it. Yay! Bam! Nope. Let's have a little bit of fun here and summon a bunch of monsters. Let's summon a bunch of monsters. Anton Blast got a release date for Switch. Yes, it did. That was cool. Sad Pizza Tower wasn't shown, and even sadder for fans of Silk Song, but yeah, it happens. I don't think Pizza Tower's coming for a while. It's a complex game. Am I excited for Hades 2? Uh, Hades wasn't my thing. I know it is for a lot of people, one for me, unfortunately. See, I'm more of the camp of Binding of Isaac and Bellatro. That's my type of game. Although I will say Bellatro is pulling some shit that I do not appreciate. It is hitting me. Uh, okay, I was on the final boss of one of the of the final blind. And it just decided, hey, by the way, one of your random jokers no longer works. And I was like, I beg your pardon? And then I just fucking lost right at the very end. I was so pissed. But it's fine. It's fine. Bullet Hells, but also I'm I'm good at Binding of Isaac. Hades killed me way too much. Uh oh! Dragon monster from your graveyard. Ooh, that's a trade. That's not good. probably gonna hurt. Yeah, this is probably gonna suck. Uh-oh! Uh, yes! You know what? Screw you, buddy! Oh, right. Cards. Shit! <laughs> I didn't read it! <laughs> Crap! I got distracted! Oh! 
No! Suck on this! Whatever the hell it is. I don't want it! <laughs> Shit. <laughs> what you got, mate? Sixty one percent. Okay. gonna see a deadly Dargan? I think I am. Oh, she was cute. The house dragon maid! Oh my god, she's huge! Another dragon maid monster you control. Special summon one dragon maid monster from your hand. Graveyard and defense position is level one higher or one lower. Ugh. Ow. That's gonna suck. Right on! <laughs> nice. All right, let's see what we got here. Okay, that's not bad. Interesting. I didn't expect Holly Angel to go there. Well, it still works. chat there's a method to my madness all right see what happens
What's gonna happen with these big dragon ladies? They're gonna destroy me. Ow. 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 I think I got you, Ike. Nothing personal. This is just what my idols do. Bam. 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 Good match, friend. Had to hit you one more time, apparently. That was a good match. Alright, sorry about that delay. Silver, get in here. You did, yeah. Yeah, you started to get out some really scary monsters. <laughs> Correct. You have every single maid in there to tend to your every whim and give you plenty of cuddles. What's up, Silver? Bring it. Let's see what you got. Yeah, it seems like a fun archetype to use. Just trading maids back and forth. They're basically tagging each other in. What's up, girl? Yeah, you get in there now. You tend to master's wounds. Okay. Cracks knuckles. Beats you senseless. Oh. Well, that's interesting. <laughs> that's very interesting. Do you already have something in your hand? Hmm. Have I played any of the Octopath Traveler games? Uh, no. I own both of them, but I've just never, uh, yeah, I've never played them. I would like to, though. They seem cool. So when I see Dark Magician, I think Dark Magician is in your deck. But let's see. Okay. Temp, how is your download coming? I think I'll just do a couple more duels and call it a night. Magnet Warriors! Ooh! I did know that, Sims. It's cool. All the different maids and the different jobs. Well, that's a nice and shiny beta, the Magnet Warrior. The thickest of dragon maids. I think I got a few of my late night viewers here. What's going on, guys? It's been a while. It's been a while since I streamed late this night. Huh? Well, that's interesting. Hmm. Are you playing me? Ah. Gotcha. You want to keep your Magnet Warrior is what I'm hearing. Well, that can be arranged. Trust me, dude.
See, this right here is why I like the trick stars. This is going to hurt a lot. And all because of Holly Angel. Yeah, this is gonna hurt. God, this archetype is so interesting. Stop! <laughs> Holy shit! Oh my god! Alright, we're gonna try it. It worked. There you go. Just a small bit of disrespect. Oh! You're dealing in dragons? Oh shit! Well now I feel really bad about this. That was me being 110% disrespectful. I apologize, this is an extremely toxic archetype. That was kind of fun. Good duel, good duel. I was very curious to see how dragons came into the Magnet Warriors. I'm guessing you had a little bit of hand-in-hand -hand with summoning the Magnet Warriors, maybe summoning Valkyrian, and then going from there. Silver, if you want to go another round, I'll, I'll let you play uh, a combo or two, and we'll see where that gets us. But uh, if you're good, if anybody else wants to play, come on in, we'll do a couple more. Temp, can I get an update on your download? While we're doing that, Silver, if you want to duel again, just let me know. All right. Bring me my next opponent. I wish to face them in mortal combat. Can anyone join? Uh, sure. Yeah, if you want to join, that's fine. There you go. Here's the deets. Come on in. You have the face of IP Mascarina. You're my friend. Would you believe me if I said I'm glad you and UDJ proved me wrong over my perspective of y'all? What did you think of us before? I'm almost scared to ask. What vibe did we give off in the beginning? And I'm glad it changed, but didn't see that coming. You're on Xbox One? Okay. Oh, do you have the the live streamer girls? Is that what your deck is? Or at least your uh your uh blah, 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 blah. Hold on, what, what is that card is that? Oh hey. It's been a hot minute since I had a bot. Wow! Electric are basically just one more of the archetype, basically sort of rechains. Oh, okay. Uh, when this car... Nouvelle's Restaurant. Wait. Is this Hungry Burger? <laughs> I think it might be Hungry Burger. No. <laughs> yes, Hungry Burger! Let's see it! 
Oh, okay. That's cool. Dude bros who like badass action games like Resident Evil games in Castlevania and hates anime. Huh. I don't think I ever gave that off, honestly, but I'm glad you think of me differently. Bring on the burger. Ah, uh, yeah, there they are! <laughs> yeah, bring on the burger! Recipe, ritual, spell. Okay. I <laughs> To be honest, I always knew you were a big weeb. What gave it away? What gave it away? Was it the constant worshipping of Love Live or the fact that I had a review channel where I mostly did anime reviews? There you are! Uh-oh. That's not good. Well, that sucks. Call it a hunch. Yeah. Hmm. You seem to be radiating weeb and you don't smell bad. Hmm. Ooh, that's fun. Thankfully, you didn't see Niskel's early content. So, funny thing about that, I got tagged in something recently. And it wasn't like anything bad or, or uh, what have you, but... It was so interesting to see somebody else's take on my old content. What was funny about this person is they did a compilation, I guess, of a lot of my earlier stuff. I basically made an imprint of my face in my hands because of the cringe. As soon as I heard my stupid voice talking over hentai, I was like, Oh, Jesus Christ, get the shit out of here. <laughs> get out of here, get that friggin' crap out of here. Oh, because you used to watch LPers, they were like that? Eh, that makes sense. Uh-oh. Ooh, you're gonna be ritual summoning. Grandma sheep knits away, yeah. The cringe skull. Hey, there's another name. Add it to the list. I want to see you get that six-star hungry burger. Let's see it, buddy. Aw, oh, man. Ow. Jesus. Am I gonna get bricked on the burger? Never. I'll never get bricked on the burger. Not when I have this. <clears throat> and then, uh... Your videos make me laugh at how cringe they were. Oh, well, yeah. That's why uh, some of them have disappeared. And why a lot of them... Uh, some of them are still up. One in particular I had to, I had to do away with. Just because, yeah, in hindsight, not the best idea. It was back at a different time. Alright, this card with a recipe card. You can excavate the top five cards of your deck. And if you do, add one. Uh, you can have the pretty pendulum lady. Which one was that? I'm not telling. You'll just have to go through my catalog of 2012 to 2014 to figure out what's missing. And by then, I'll be long gone. Oh, are we gonna get a pendulum summon? Target one monster with a special summon this card. Change that monster to battle position. Hmm. Okay. 
Yeah. Oh. Oh, here we go. Protege Nouvelle. This card is special summon, draw a card. Okay. You and UDJ ended up being the coolest guys on the internet for me. Aw, thank you. I'm glad you have enjoyed what we've brought for over 10 years. It still feels weird to hear that I've been on the internet for a very long time. I've been watching videos on the internet for a long time, and nothing made me realize that more than knowing that AVGN is close to 20 years old. And the fact that when I started Let's Playing, I took advice from Retsupre, who came from the Something Awful forums. That was kind of the, the diving board to get me on board. They basically said, here's what you don't do. Was it the Phoenix Drive videos? Nope, those are still up. In fact, the the last of the three finally got hit with an age restriction after over ten years. I don't know why it took that long. Bam! Suck on that, nerd! This probably won't do anything. Oh my god, a chain five?! Negate the activation! No! <laughs> oh god! <laughs> you got me good! Oh god, a, a pendulum gate of eights? Uh oh. Hmm. This is gonna hurt, isn't it? Now, yes. Still in it. Thank God. Uh, what else we got? Yep, guy game is still up. Uh oh. Burger? Nope, no burger yet. Oh, bail! Face of cards your opponent currently controls at the end of the turn. Okay, okay, okay. And if this was card special summon, tribute as many monsters in. What the hell? Oh, that's not good. Oh, you're just sauteing your cards back in. Oh my god! Stream went? No. <laughs> no. Well, that's not good. Hmm. Shit. Shit! I didn't want to do that. Aw, oh, god damn it. Fuck! I misclicked! <laughs> I can't believe I did that! Fuck! Uh oh! Hungry Burger's coming! Uh oh. Yep, there's the burger! <laughs> Uh, you know what? Let's, uh... Yeah, let's go ahead and do one of these here. What's up, man? Have a card. <laughs> Shit. Uh... Yeah, but... Well, I just got wrecked by a by an entire kitchen. 
entire kitchen full of demons. Figured you'd like Hololive, since they do actual idol work when they're not streaming. So do idols. I pick and choose my cutesy characters. Oh my god, you just cleared my entire field. Please have your last attack be the burger. For the memes. Just hit me good with Bale and... Oh, shit. Sorry, sorry, sorry. Uh, yep, there we go. And now hit me with, uh, Balamunier. There you go. And here comes the burger! <laughs> here it comes! <laughs> oh, no! The final blow was due to Hungry Burger! <laughs> uh, prepped, cooked, served, how would you rate this meal? Delicious. Absolutely five out of five stars. Oh, uh, that was a great duel, mate. That was fun. My OneDrive space is running low. Oh, no. So? All right. I've got one more in me. I am getting very tired. Tried so hard to get to, to get the burger out. <laughs> that was awesome. That was so good. Thank you very much for that. That was fantastic. All right. One more challenger. And then we'll call it a night. Who's got some fight left in him? Yu-Gi-Oh! can get really silly, but it is such a fast game nowadays that most of the time the game is over in two turns. So, I'm happy to have seen so many different archetypes. And I'm just having a good time. This is fun. Alright, bring it on, you dragon master. Master of all things Dragon Maid. Maybe Ojamas should be a deck I try to put together. That'd be a fun deck. Another gag deck. Oh my god, it's the Ojamas. Whoa. And then the whole universe explodes thanks to Ojamas. My only real experience with Death Builder games. I think at this speed you're going to make me feel like I'm watching a speedrun of Fast Forward. Yeah, so the replays I was showing earlier, that's with all the pausing cut out. That's how fast it is. And when I watch people's videos for Master Duel on YouTube, they're played like that. So it's just like bam, 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 bam. I barely have time to read what the cards actually do. That's a Big monster. Red Eyes Darkness Metal Dragon? Did you change up your deck in the background? Which Love Live show do you like so far? So that's the funny thing. I adore Love Live and all the girls that show up in the show. I have only watched up to Aqua. So I have only watched up to Sunshine. Everything after that, I have not watched. Because that is when I hit my roadblock. That's when I stopped doing reviews. It's basically when I stopped watching anime for the longest time. I got burnt the fuck out to the point where I hated working on stuff. It, it was bad time. Long story short. So, yeah, that's, that's what you had uh, and why I haven't done or watched much of anything. Yeah, so at least I still had my comfort in Aqua <laughs> and Muse. That's good. Okay. Yep, maybe next time. Maybe by then I'll have an Exodia deck. 
You all fear me. Did I ever get back into it? Mm, not really. The, the only anime I've really watched in, like, the long few years since I watched it religiously was My Hero and recently Spy Family. That's all I've watched. Oh dear. I'm about to be hurt by a giant woman. Ow! Pain. Pain. In the form of a maid. Oh dear lord. Whatever your effect is, no! Ow. Alright, let's see what your big buff dragon ladies have got. Can you look at your opponent's deck after the duel? I think so, yes. Yeah, there's a way to view the deck that you lost to, but I think it's only for online. Like, if you're just here palling around with people... Or maybe there is an option. We'll check. We'll take a look-see. Phase special summon one dragon monster from your hand or graveyard. Ooh, that is a good structure deck. Holy shit! We're not doing this. Beware the power of my cute angels.
Later, Bioshock. Thanks for stopping by. Appreciate you. You won't have to worry about us acting like dude bros. Not gonna say been there, done that, but... I just don't like that lifestyle. Ooh, that's fun. Okay. And that's game. That was fun. Boom. Bam. Good duel, Ike. You actually had me scared of your dragon ladies. Uh, all right. I'm sorry. Don't even give me that. That was fun. That was fun. That was great.